children young and old are on the hunt for Easter eggs and well, you don't have to look any further than the Delmarva Life Kitchen to find a delicious egg appetizer. You, by the way, will also find the man who is in charge, <laughs> Chef Jesus Gordiani with Benvenuto Restaurant. Yeah. What are we making today, Chef? Well, first of all, I'm so happy to be here. Glad you're here. Yeah, we're happy to have you here. Happy Tuesday. Yeah. So we are going to showcase a few items. We're actually a couple items off of our new spring summer menu. All right? Okay. So you guys like deviled eggs, right? Yeah, oh, yeah. Absolutely. Right. So check this out, right? These are our deviled eggs that we do. Now, these are cool little vessels that you can pretty much go anywhere, Lisa. You yeah. can find these. I know these you're, are cool. Yes, you mentioned you and your husband may be looking mm -hmm. for something mm -hmm. like this. And you can find these in any gourmet shop. Yeah. Sure. Right? You know, any, any store you walk into, you can find these. They're not a, that expensive. So what I did was I just boiled these eggs out like you guys do at home. All right? And I use Dijon mustard, real Dijon mustard. It's oh. made with white wine. Oh, okay. oh. French style mustard. A little bit of mayo, right? Your favorite. And I just whip it up, a little salt and pepper, and then I take a pastry bag. These are disposable pastry bags. I uh -huh. put a star tip on it, and then just simply take your little yolk mixer, all right, and just simply place it in the bag. It's so easy to do. And as know? far as, as consistency, you just you put enough uh, Dijon mustard in it. Yes, we we don't have a standard recipe for this mm -hmm. at the restaurant. It's kind of just made by by eye. You look at it, you see how it looks see how it feels. You want to whip it up so that it has a nice consistency. Mm -hmm. You put it in this bag and this is great for entertaining at home because you make it ahead of time. Yeah. Right? You make these ahead of time and your guests are always very impressed but look there's only so much you can do with deviled eggs. So these are really cool. So what I do now is I bring these over here. I work from left to right. I don't know why. Okay. So we'll start on this guy here and just watch how simple it is. See? Oh, that's just gorgeous. Almost, almost like decorating a cake. Mm -hmm. Right? All right, and I'm not a pastry chef, but I could dabble Can a I little try? bit. Absolutely. <laughs> Which means Jimmy has to try too. Yeah, no, yes. no, 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 no. Yes. This, this, I, this, I'm going to show you how easy here. it is. Show me how easy it is, no, Lisa. I, I'm, oh, wow, that's really easy. Isn't it? Well, mine's not as pretty, but. No, I think Oh, so now I got to do it? Yeah. I think it's not great. <laughs> Mine looks like it's pointing. What makes yeah. you think I know what I'm doing? <laughs> Yours looks like ice cream. There you go. Yeah, like soft serve ice cream. Very nice. Oh, Jimmy, you're good at that. He did it, didn't he? He wow. sure did. Now, now let's say you came back and you're like, wow, I don't like the way that I looks. Like the way that looks. You can always fix it, I right? Fix you it. just kind of just go right above it. Oh, see? there you go. Because I that. didn't have nearly as much in mind as you had here. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Like right. that, perfect. And look, and it look, all looks like it was made by one person. It was right? Made by now, what we're going to do is right now they're just kind of cool looking deviled eggs, mm -hmm. all right? What I like to do is I like to hit my deviled eggs with bacon. Oh, of course. So this is pancetta. If you guys don't know what yeah, pancetta is, uh -huh. it's just Italian bacon. Uh -huh. It smells delicious. Right. Yeah. Yes, yes, it does. Nice and smoky. You smell it. Mm. Mm. You don't have to put your no, nose no, down no. in it. I want to eat it. I want to eat it. So we're going to do a little bit of bacon. Look at that. All right. It's okay if it gets everywhere. All right. That's what makes it good. Yes, yes. Mm. You know, have fun with your food, right? <laughs> Absolutely. So we put a little bit of bacon you, you give on us, here. We're allowed to play with our Oh, food, my right? goodness, right? But check this out. We're going we're gonna to one-up this. Now, you know what this is here, right? Oh, a oh, big bowl of crab meat. Look at that. Look at all that crab meat. Beautiful, beautiful jumbo lump. Now, what we're going to do is just take some nice big lumps, and hey, this is exactly how you're going to get it at the restaurant, all right? Oh, We press wow. these in. Your new spring menu. Oh, my goodness, yes. This is on the new uh, spring and summer menu. Nice big lumps of crab meat. Mm. Okay. And then, of course, you have to keep it fresh. Right. Right, so before it goes out to that table. This is a filla cress, which is one of my favorite. It's kind of, it tastes like, it tastes like sweet peas to me, all right? Uh -huh. And then these just kind of bury these right in there. And it just brings a nice, you know, uh, pop of freshness sure. to anything that you do. Maybe we go across, we put one in here, right? And then for good measure, we're gonna put another one. I like to pick these out. Hey, this one looks good. He looks really good. And we're gonna put him here. And I mean, just look at that. We literally, in a matter of seconds, just put together elevated these beautiful and deviled it's, eggs. And it's pretty on the table. Yes, it really is. So we're gonna set these over here because you guys are definitely gonna wanna try these. You know what, okay. I'm all right. I'm, if you don't mind, I'm gonna try oh, one right please. now. We're gonna try one, and, and then, then we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna take a little please. break here. Because when we come back, we got a lot more work to do, mm -hmm. don't we? See, right. here's the thing. It would be hard for me to not eat all of these and not ever make it to the rest of the food. <laughs> <laughs> hey, putting the whole thing in. Right? That's the way it's done. That's good, isn't it? <laughs> that is so good. All right. When we come back, we are going to get to the grouper.
Mm -hmm. That's going to be a lot of fun. Stick around. Don't worry about life. We'll be right back. We are still in the Delmarva Life uh, uh, kitchen with uh, Chef Jesus Gordiani. Hey now. Yeah. He let's just call him Zeus. Zeus. We've yes. Done, Chef Zeus. We've done deviled eggs and now mm -hmm. we are doing grouper. Grouper. All right. This is the new grouper off our menu. Mm -hmm. no. So well, I, when I think grouper, I think the big. Yes. So those are the Goliath groupers, right? Okay. And I think those guys are protected. We can't really eat those. Is this with Samson? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's a good one. Yes. <laughs> so this here is our ember. Uh, spice, we call it. There's apple in here. Apple and yes. spice? Yes, there's garlic, garlic powder. You can see the big chunks of garlic. There's onion, there's sugar, oh, all wow. kinds of good stuff. It just gives this uh, fish a really, really uh, good flavor. And, and this texture. pan is super hot. Super I hot. Okay. Smoking. Hey guys, and now you guys at home, whenever you're doing, so always away from you always yep. away in from case me. there's any splash. And you can hear that, right? Mm. And that's the sound that you want. We're going to remove this guy, we're going to put him back here. All right, and you can literally step over here. You can okay. just smell that. Oh, oh yeah, oh, oh yeah, no, no, oh, oh yeah, mm -hmm. right? Oh this my! Smell delicious. Mm -hmm. And remember, you don't want to overcook your fish, and this no. only takes seconds. Just kind of give him a little shake, make sure that he's nice and loose. And now, I'm going to show you how quick this is. We're just going to give this a quick flip, and you're going to see the color. Look at that! Oh wow! See how quick that was? Yeah. All right. And that's due to all the spices and everything that's, you know, mm -hmm. in, in this mix here. It's absolutely delicious. So, Jimmy, Good. I'm going to give you the honors. We're going to put this in this oven here. Okay. That's been preheated. Pan and all. Pan and all. Yep. Right. So, why, why, why on the cooktop first? Uh, that's how you develop good flavor, and the best way to get flavor is by sear, all sure, right? Sure. So now, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to get our rice going. And this is our black saffron rice, all right, again, nice and smoky. And we're just going to kind of warm this up, okay? You're crazy about saffron, aren't you? I love saffron. It's one of my favorite things to cook with. Yeah. Fine. You need to write that down. I need mm -hmm. to, yeah. That might be a good song someday. Yes, yes. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get that going, get that nice and hot. Mm -hmm. Now, what we're going to do is, while you're oh tending to this, so good. it does, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. We're going to finish off our pineapple salsa. All okay. right, so what we did was we grilled this salsa first. See the color? Oh, so All that's right. a pineapple. You yes, grilled this is, the pineapple. This is pineapple. Okay. okay. We grilled this uh, pineapple for this pineapple salsa. To this, we're going to add some red bell pepper. At this we're point, I add, say, Ooh, should pretty. I be moving Ooh, this yeah. around? Yes, ma'am. Get that nice and hot. We're also going to use some cilantro. All right. And would you mind passing me a half of that lime there? Some great color. There mm -hmm. you go. Thank you so much. And we're going to take that fork as well. Oh. And this is one of the best ways to juice your limes. Is just put a put a fork in it. All right, and just give that a nice Never little. thought of that. Uh-huh. Never thought That's of that. That's the way we do it. All right. And then we're going to use a little bit of salt and pepper. Pardon my reach here. No problem. Okay. And we are going to salt this up. And a little bit of pepper. How are we looking over there with that it's, rice? It's, it's getting really dark. dark. I mean, it was dark want. to begin with. Yes. That's what so we want? So you see that? That's almost oh, called. Oh, that's what you want. Yeah, that's I thought what it calls, was burning. <laughs> yeah, socorat. So socorat okay. is what you find in paella. Mm -hmm. Now we can literally turn this guy off. Okay. okay? Yep. Mm -hmm. So he's good. Now. We're going to mix this together, okay? And look at the colors on that. That's so gorgeous. Yes, it, right? really is. it really is. Really, really is. It really is. And charring this pineapple, just grilling it, brings out so much more flavor. Now we're looking at plating, right? Right. Plating, pretty so plate. what we're going to do is we're going to use black mm -hmm. today because Lisa wanted to use black. Because <laughs> it All goes right? with our nice plate. It does. It does. And White. it just brings contrast, mm -hmm. right? So what we simply do now is we take our rice. So we're going to lay our rice right here. So we're going to kind of plate off to the side a little bit, all right? Because we are trying to be artiste. Artiste, artiste. right? Artiste. So we do some nice black rice here. See how beautiful it looks already? It's gorgeous. It blends in, right? Mm -hmm. I've never it had blends this in. No? No. So it's literally white rice that's been cooked down with squid ink, garlic, squid onions, ink? and saffron. Really? And that's how you get the color. Okay. Right? How about that? So now what we're going to do is Jimmy Are we ready for fish? is going to pour our fish out. Remember, it's the hot. fish does not take long. Oh, he's pro. He knows mm -hmm. what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. Right? We're going to yeah, set that right here on the hot okay. stove top. Look at that. Mm. And the way you can tell, literally, is just by kind of, see that? Starting to right. kind of milk a little bit. Okay. And what we then do is just take this beautiful piece of fish and we're going to nestle this right on top. Oh my goodness. Look at that, <laughs> right? I was now, so happy with the uh, deviled eggs right, right now. <laughs> now check this out. This is where it gets fun. All right, I love playing with my food. So we're going to take some of this pineapple salsa. And you can already see how beautiful ah. the contrast is. Look at that, all right? 
So we're going to lay this down. All right, we're going to pull RP some of these guys. Here. Yes, yes. Now check this out. We're going to use this is our roasted pepper coolie, okay? Okay. Which is going to look great on this plate. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a dot here. Look at that. See how it pops? It does. Another dot there, and then we're going to put little dots. All right, just like that. I mean, look how nice that That's looks already. Gorgeous. Right? <laughs> You're amazing. Now, thank you, Jimmy. <laughs> now, at the restaurant, we use leeks, mm -hmm. we use onions, to whatever we can get that day, get okay. it fresh. So and I what took are these? Are these are these are crispy onions. So what I did with these was I just kind of soaked them in buttermilk, all right, and then dredged them in flour, a little corn uh, cornstarch, and um, and just deep fried them. And all right? it's done. And oh, it's done. Got yeah. a little green on it. And then we're going to put a little bit of our beautiful signature microgreens on that. And we also have height on this. You see the height, Jimmy? Come down here and look. Oh my goodness! See that? You have to come down and look. No. You see that? You see how we're we're building that height? It's a 3D plate. This it is It really incredible. is. All right. Thank hey, you. Camera guy, can you get that? You gotta get, the, you gotta get that height. We're gonna, do that a three, height. we're gonna do a 360. There so you, you go. Look so at you that. You can really see. Oh my Zeus goodness. Zeus 360 that. in the Delmar yes, Village is kitchen. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. All, All right. right. We gotta All right. Do I want it, you guys to try. We gotta yeah. do it. You guys tell me what you think. Again, thank you so much. And you said this is available on your new menu. <laughs> yes, it is. On our new menu. You have to stop in at Benvenuto to try it. Yeah. Oh my. How good is that? That is excellent. You see how fast that was? That was very fast. Thank you so much. Do you have a time on that? I, I don't know, <laughs> but they're telling us we got to go. Okay, we All have right. to go. Zeus, thank you so much. Thank you Check so much. Check out the spring menu at Benvenuto. Yeah.